Hi, welcome back to the channel. Replacing a car battery is a common maintenance task that many car owners will encounter. While the process of removing the old battery and installing a new one can be straightforward, there are several important steps and considerations to take into account after the replacement to ensure your vehicle operates smoothly and safely. This video will go into the essential actions and tips for what to do after replacing a car battery. After replacing the battery, it's crucial to inspect and clean the battery terminals and cable connectors. Corrosion can build up over time on the battery terminals and can interfere with the electrical connection between the battery and the vehicle. Look for any signs of corrosion, which typically appears as a white or bluish powdery substance. Use a battery terminal cleaner or a mixture of baking soda and water to clean the terminals and connectors. Scrub them with a wire brush to remove any buildup. Ensure the area is dry before reconnecting. Proper mounting of the new battery is essential for both safety and performance. An unsecured battery can lead to damage and pose a hazard. Make sure the battery is securely fastened using the appropriate hold-down hardware. The battery should not move when you try to wiggle it. Double-check that the positive and negative terminals are correctly connected. Reversing them can cause serious damage to the vehicle's electrical system. Modern vehicles are equipped with numerous electronic systems that may be affected by a battery replacement. Resetting these systems is often necessary to restore functionality. Reset the clock and radio presets as these are typically lost when the battery is disconnected. Some vehicles have anti-theft systems that require a code to be entered after a battery replacement. Refer to your owner's manual for instructions on how to reset these systems. In some vehicles, power windows and sunroofs need to be recalibrated after the battery is replaced. This can usually be done by fully opening and then fully closing the windows and sunroof. Even though the battery is new, it's a good idea to perform a battery test to ensure it is functioning correctly. Use a multimeter to check the voltage of the battery. A fully charged battery should read around 12.6 volts or higher. A more comprehensive tests can be performed at an auto parts store or service center, where the battery's ability to hold a charge under load is tested. The vehicle's charging system should be checked to ensure it is functioning properly as a faulty alternator or regulator can lead to premature battery failure. Use a multimeter to check the alternator's output. With the engine running, it should produce between 13.7 and 14.7 volts. Inspect the condition of the serpentine belt that drives the alternator. Look for signs of wear, cracking, or fraying, and replace the belt if necessary. After replacing the battery, it's beneficial to drive the vehicle for at least 15 to 20 minutes. This allows the alternator to recharge the new battery and helps the vehicle's computer systems to recalibrate. Pay attention to any unusual sounds, dashboard warning lights, or performance issues during the initial drive. If anything seems off, further inspection or professional diagnosis may be required. Proper disposal of the old battery is important for environmental and safety reasons. Most auto parts stores and service centers accept old batteries for recycling. There may even be a core charge refund when you return the old battery. Handle the old battery carefully to avoid spills of battery acid. Use gloves and avoid contact with the skin. Keeping records of maintenance is important for future reference and can be beneficial if you sell the vehicle. Note the date of the battery replacement in your vehicle maintenance records. Keep the receipt and warranty information for the new battery. Many batteries come with a warranty, and having this documentation can be useful if the battery fails prematurely. If the old battery failed prematurely, it might be indicative of an underlying issue within the vehicle's electrical system. Test for parasitic drains, which can deplete the battery even when the vehicle is off. This can be done using a multimeter set to measure current draw. Have professional inspect the vehicle's electrical system if you suspect there are issues that could have contributed to the battery's failure. Replacing a car battery is a relatively simple task, but the steps taken afterward are critical for ensuring the longevity and performance of the new battery and the overall health of the vehicle. 
from inspecting and cleaning connections to resetting electronic systems and verifying the charging system. Each step plays a vital role in maintaining your car's reliability. Additionally, proper disposal of the old battery and documenting the replacement are essential practices that contribute to environmental responsibility and effective vehicle maintenance. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, share, and also subscribe to this channel for more informative videos.